Hi, this is Roy at UBalance. Uh, I just wanted to introduce you to the Abs for Breakfast challenge, so to speak. So if you're getting ready to go on vacation, it's good to try to start getting active in preparation for vacation. Abs for Breakfast means take this quick three-part workout and do it in under five minutes, and then you can reward yourself with breakfast. But don't have breakfast until you do um, the Abs workout. It's pretty simple. We're going to do three moves, and I'll give you some modifications as we do them. You're going to go ahead and start off by lying on your back with your arms over your head. You're going to reach across and kind of meet your knee or your thigh with your forearm of the opposite arm. So right to left, left to right. All right. So we're going to do this 10 times the first time we do it. And then the next time you do it, you can challenge yourself by doing 12 reps. And then the next round, you can challenge yourself by doing 16 reps. It just needs to be an even number. So if you need to modify it, you can bend your knees and do it like that, and you can also support your head and neck. And that will make your lower back or your neck as well. You can do an alternate version like that. All right, then we're going to do 20 bicycle punches. So we're just going to bring our left elbow, opposite knee, supporting your head, right to left, left to right. We're going to do 20 of these in the second round here. And you can stick with 20. These are usually pretty good. If you want to try for 30 in that next round, you can, or 24 as long as it's even. If you're backwards on this one, you can go ahead and put your feet down and come up off the ground like that. And if it really hurts, you can just keep the feet down and just come right to left like that. Once we get those 20, we're going to flip over. We're going to go into the plank position, go on your elbows like this. We're up on your hands, whichever your wrists prefer. Keep your core nice and strong. We're just going to tap our toes right to left. So the theme of this workout is going to be your abs and your obliques, or your abs and waist. And we'll do this one 12 times, but you can try to up the ante in the next few rounds to make it a progressive workout. Or you can just start with 10 reps of the first exercise we did when we were in the cross crunch. We're going to go right back into the next step. We're not going to take a breath. We're just going to go right to left, left to right. If you're able to up the ante this round, go for it. Otherwise, stick with the number you had before. And then maybe the next time you do it, you can. After we do 12 of those or 10 of those, we're going to do our 20 bicycles. Remember, you can modify off the ground if you need to. Then we'll flip back over into that plank. And we'll do those toe taps from your hands or your elbows. To modify that last one, I didn't mention the first one. You're just going to go from your knees if your lower back starts to hurt. So you're going to do three rounds. You're not going to take a break. I recommend picking a nice upbeat song that's about five minutes and try to do the ab workout under that five minutes. And you'll be good to go for your abs on the day.